welcome back to the channel. For those of you who don't know, my name is Chris Moore, and in today's video, we've got a 2006 GSXR 750. This thing is crazy clean. We are going to be doing a ECU flash and dyno tune on this bike today. The customer just recently put on a M4 slip-on with cat delete pipe and has complained that he has basically lost horsepower. He's like, the bike just don't feel the way it used to. And the reason for that is the bike is running crazy lean, meaning not getting enough fuel. So the customer upped the airflow of the engine a lot, and we have to balance that out by upping the fuel flow of the engine. Everything has to be balanced out and work together. You see how clean this bike is, guys? Has 9,000 miles on it. Can you believe the guy said he got it for $2,000? What, two grand? Said he didn't even use his gun. I can't believe it. This is a steal of a deal on this thing. $2,000 bike. Let's see what this thing does compared to a brand new 750. Remember, a brand new 750 puts out around 130, 132. Well, let's just say 130 with a slip on and an ECU flash. Let's see what we can get out of this basically 15 year old GSXR 750. Even though it looks brand new, it's still 15 years old. Let's see what we can get compared to modern day bikes. pull on this 750 let's see if the customer was right did he lose power of course we don't know the exact numbers he would have made with the stock exhaust but let's see how far off this thing is what's going on this is our air fuel ratio chart down here the higher this num the curve goes up here the leaner the bike is lean means not getting enough fuel so you can see we max out the gauge here on the dyno and you can see we almost max it out right there and then we're too lean out here now the crazy thing was this ecu has been flashed by another company sadly enough just because you have a shop don't mean you should have a keyboard and a flashing equipment Remember guys, not everyone with a stethoscope is a doctor. So we're gonna get this thing straightened out and get this thing doing what it needs to do. We'll see what happens. All right guys, here we go. I got to where you should be able to see the air fuel gauge again. After we've done some tuning, this thing is starting to get dialed in and make better horsepower, but better yet, drive much smoother. Oh, 
on this bike ended up gaining five horsepower which is strong on a 750 percentage wise uh, we made 55 foot pounds of torque you can see we fixed all the lean humps in it you can see there where we picked up a good bit of power this is around 8,000 rpms we went from 73 to 80 so that's a huge gain 72 to 78 and then up top we gained six seven horsepower everywhere up top so overall big gains out of this thing for an 06 model, not only is this bike super clean, but this bike makes really good horsepower compared to what the brand new ones do. This guy said he paid $2,000 for this thing, guys. That's unbelievable. A brand new bike like this is 12.5. From 12,000 to 2,000, that's $10,000 difference, and he made three horsepower less. That's a hell of a deal, guys. Check him out, or check me out, moremafia.com and we can get you an ecu flash and set up i can get you an m4 exhaust whatever you guys need for your gsxr we can get you fixed up zx10 honda cbr whatever you got we'll get you fixed up thanks for watching guys be sure to subscribe to the channel may 15th don't forget it's going down galat motorsports park me versus ricky gadson battle of the brand suzuki versus kawasaki the best of the best gsxr 1000 versus the best of the best zx10 it's going down. Who's coming out on top? Smash that like button and we'll see you next time.